Good afternoon and welcome to Eye on the Desert. I'm your host, Patrick Evans. Today, we're talking about a fantastic opportunity for you to see some brand new artwork, and it's free and it's very accessible. With me is Bill Shinsky from the CV Art Center. Bill, welcome back to the program. Nice to see you. Good to see you, Patrick. Thanks for having us. Uh, and please introduce me to your two friends. On my right is Julie Wayman, and on my left is Kim Manfredi. And they are two of the artists in uh, a drive-by exhibition on the north wall of the CV Art Center that is called Artists Comment. Uh, and for this, you obviously, the, the pandemic has made it impossible for people to, to come and see art exhibitions in the traditional way. Uh, so you've actually yeah. hung this exhibit on the side of the building so people can come and see this and experience it. Uh, tell me about how that how that worked out and, and tell me about the art that's that's hanging there. Well, when I decided to do it outside, since we can do it inside, I, I thought, OK, uh, scale has a lot to do with it. So each artist was given a minimum of eight feet by eight feet to do something. They were each given two pieces of four by eight plywood and they could do whatever they wanted to. It. There was no. Uh, no basic theme, except they needed to create comment. Tell me a little bit about the art that you put together. I'll let the artists speak for themselves. Julie. So I made nine panels, each 24 by 30, um, that are a combination of, of altar, shrine, and uh, a quinceanera dress that I sourced locally from uh, Martha's Village uh, thrift shop, and also from a company in Ontario, called Berkeley Ergonomics, which supplied me with the materials that, uh, that I use. I've made an eight foot by eight foot painting that refers to the Salton Sea. In addition to the painting on the ground lie uh, handmade ceramic birds, which refer to the 400 species of migrating birds that utilize that fragile environment um, annually. And I was using that imagery as a metaphor for our own kind of fragile existence and our, our dependence on our world and the goodness of others for survival. So um, it was just a great opportunity for me to make a big work uh, and talk to the residents of, of the Coachella Valley. Well, it is, uh, you know, I think fascinating because of the scope and the size of the artwork. Uh, Bill, folks can come by anytime. Tell everybody exactly where you're located so that they can come by and do exactly as you say, drive by and experience the artwork. The building is located at 45140 Town Street. The works are on the north side of the building, and we're two doors away from Indio City Hall, near Town and Miles. And there's a total of seven artists in this, and three of those artists are grad students at Otis College of Art and Design in L.A. Well, I know that people will want to experience this, and that's fantastic that you've been able to put this together so that people can experience the artwork. Uh, and again, it's free. It is open to the public. All you have to do is drive by and check it out there on wow. Town Street in India. It'll be a continuing project every Excellent. quarter. Who works? Excellent. Well, we'll check back in and, and see how it continues to progress. Thanks. Thank you both. Thank, Thank you, you all Thanks, three Patrick. of you for, for being here on Eye in the Desert today. Thank you. Bye now. Bye.